Welcome to a day in my life. If you're new to my channel, I'm a data scientist that's been living and working in the DC area for a little bit over a year now. A lot of things can happen in a typical day, so I want to show you exactly what goes on in a typical weekday and how I manage to balance work, grad school, fitness, YouTube, and whatever my mind tells me to do that day. Please, please, please like and subscribe. Join the Data Life community by commenting what topics you want to see me talk about, and most importantly, enjoy the video. Let's get it started. The first thing I do, I wake up at 5 a.m. every day, go for a jog for about seven miles, then I go work out, then I shower, eat breakfast, put on some nice work clothes to make me feel more productive. Oh, that's the BS alarm going off. It's like, let me show you what a real day is actually like. The way my day actually begins is me waking up and taking my morning meetings from my uh, bed office. Every morning my team has a touch base where we discuss the status of our projects and what we'll be working on that day. I also make sure to respond to emails and set up any meetings I need for that day. After that, I make an attempt to get out of my bed and make breakfast. You know, this takes a lot of effort, it could go either way. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Always need to have eggs, major key. Always need to have pork with breakfast and some pineapple, best fruit ever. Perfect. After some nourishment, now I'm ahead to the bedroom office and really get the workday started. Usually I have two meetings during the day max, so my schedule is pretty clear and I can just focus on my work. What you see here is me researching the Facebook profit time series model, which I'm actually deploying in our ML pipeline pretty soon. We out here uh, in the studio. We don't really make hits though, we just run algorithms. That being said, I am in charge of several processes that need to be run monthly or weekly. I try to get these running before lunch because they can take hours and I need to see the results before the end of the day. Uh, another little fun fact, everything my team does is an RStudio server so I'm pretty good with R. Once I got everything running that needs to be, I go back to the fun stuff, model building. One of the reasons I was actually brought to this team was my past experience with time series. Even though we're doing fraud detection, we're starting to use time series to predict expected values and determine outliers. And that, my friends, is the face of a man who finally got his code to run. I went to too many happy hours this week, so I'm literally just having a piece of salmon for lunch. Garlic and onion powder goes on everything. If you disagree, we just can't be friends. Also some rub that butt seasoning. Don't knock it till you try it. Do, 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 do. I'm a professional chef. Lunch time is also TikTok time, and I get ready to go in front of the camera and make some TikTok content. Yes, sir, you can follow Data Life on more than one platform. After lunch is typically when I'll have most of my meetings, you can see me in one right now. And I usually switch to my kitchen office just because I like a change of scenery. And if I'm not sending in on meetings, I'll continue to work on my projects. I can't go into crazy detail about my meetings and projects, but I've been working on neural networks, random forests, regression models, and a lot of tableau visualizations, all for the client. As the workday ends, I take notes on where I left off, make sure all the processes have run smoothly, and write down what I'm going to say in the next morning's touch base. And then after work, it's straight to the gym. The rest of my day could be spent doing things like exploring DC, shooting some YouTube videos, editing some YouTube videos, doing a little grad school work, and of course, just chilling, hanging out with the squad. <laughs> Do the first ever vlog. Hey. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Dinner time means the day is winding down and I'm back home. One last meal a day before we shut it all down. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to leave a comment on what type of video you'd like to see me do next. Peace. Adios. Deuces.